we'll be working today to get the basic structure in. I, I like to think of it in symphonic form where you get the melody laid down and then you come back with the instrumentation which is filling with sod, berms that come up here, that whole sense of orchestrating where this blends into the big vista that we've got here. To see all the mining, see all of the heavy industrial elements intermingled with the earth. Um, that's where all of this imagery comes from. I think the artwork has to be about our day and time. Its actual title is um, based on a musical term that basically means a grand crescendo that builds. I just uh, saw the, the snow up on the edge of the mountains and so that's where this white reference comes from very, very linear that we Westerners can see at a far distance. Take me through the process of actually getting everything here to the point where you can start install. First of all, I either make the work and then I find a place for it, or I have an opportunity presented such as a show and they, they say, do you have some ideas? And I rough in ideas in sketch form. I sketch things two-dimensionally, put the concept out, then I start uh, fabricating it and there are certain places where this was physically separated so that I could ship it on a 20 foot or 24 foot bed truck. When I do the final burn and, and work, that's how I finally finish it. I get rid of everyone and I just kind of poetically walk around and try to look at the poetics of what separates this from just being materials and objects. What type of reactions do you typically get from folks that, that see your work? I've had people come by and say, what an intrusion, or what an interruption, or what the hell is that? I also have had a lot of people say, well, you know what it looks like to me. Well, that's a little bit of the abstractness of it, is the materials, the forms, the colors, the even horizontal sensibility is all from our world up here, uh, the world of the West. And if you put it out in the public, we all share this public space and everybody has an opinion. And they're very willing to offer it, even if you don't always want to hear it. Um, I've, I've learned to have real emotional armor up though. I feel like I'm very much a Westerner and that showing my work here in the West and in the heart of the West, uh, Wyoming, gives me the most attuned audience. Out here, I don't need to explain how to look left to right. I don't need to explain big spaces around open areas. I don't need to explain something low to the ground with Big Scott. I feel like people understand that out here. So I'm really excited about the opportunity for people to engage with this.